after receiving insightful feedback from their Tomasic mentors. It's very critical you get that um, stable demand. This is a chance for you, as a, you could call it as a social experiment to understand your customers' customer better. The two social enterprises conduct experiments with the public, hoping to learn more about their customers. We at Sage Restaurant today to tackle some of the negative connotations that our products tend to face from our clients. Yeah, so we are excited to see what their reaction or what their feedback is and how they feel about it when we tell them the truth. Hey, welcome to Sage Restaurant and Bar. Today we have an eco-friendly menu. Would you all like to try it? Sure, why not? Why not? Sounds good, right? Sounds good, right? Yeah, yeah. okay. Can... Right. You get it prepared. Thank you. Thank you. As street arts and the restaurant chef get to work, Ugly Food are just about to get started on their own experiment. So today we are more raising awareness about unnecessary food waste and it's actually a good time for us to have a social experiment. I hope that we will be able to get some honest and authentic responses from the public today on how they perceive food made from Ugly Food. Ugly Food has prepared three cups of juice. Cup A is store-bought. Cup B is juice from good-looking fruits, and Cup C is juice from ugly food. Okay, which one you like the, the flavor the most? Uh, the taste. One of these. Two. One of these two. It's about the same. It's about the same. Yeah. Okay. Preferably it's B. D. It's more fresh. Those are maybe C. No? Maybe C. First. Yeah. Second. Third. Through the taste test, we realised that the consumers couldn't tell the difference between the juice. I think we are taking a good step forward in bettering our business pitch and building our sustainable business. Back at Sage Restaurant, diners are just about to tuck into the specially prepared Three Dots dish. Hello, hello. So how's the food? Uh, it's alright. Quite nice. We will show you the ingredient that made up this dish. Okay. And we'll explain to you further. The minute when we brought out the, the ingredients, uh, you can see a bit of hesitant in their, in, their, in their faces after that, they're like, oh, mm. There's actually nothing wrong with it, yeah. but it's actually undersized kampong chicken, and these are normally thrown away. So what, what do you guys think? No, you don't have to tell me that this food is actually rejected or something like that. And I, I wouldn't know, I wouldn't know, I wouldn't be able to tell the difference. The huge learning point here is that we shouldn't actively try to promote to our customers to associate their branding with the image of reducing food waste because what we thought might bring them business might actually cause them to lose business. Having received valuable customer feedback, the social enterprises must test what they've learned through business trials with actual customer orders. Will they succeed in improving their businesses? Find out on the next episode of Unwanted Food.